What's going on guys? It's Time Zone. Welcome back to our Mario Odyssey Let's Play. In the last episode, we had a crazy amazing time at at Pauline's Festival in New Donk City and it was just one of the best experiences I've had with this game so far. It was just insanely it was beautiful. It was Did that Did the ship just blink at me? <laughs> Well, anyways, um, it was beautiful, the music was incredible, the atmosphere was just, it was just, I feel like that encapsulated everything that Mario Odyssey was about, it was just a pure celebration, pure excitement and joy, and it was just beautiful. I was, I, I had to take a little bit of a break, <laughs> had some dinner since the last episode, uh, and uh, yeah, I am bulk recording again because I only really get time on weekends to record, but... Let's forget about all that and just move right on to the next kingdom. I think I was considering leaving uh, another episode for New Donk City and Metro Kingdom, but you just can't top what just happened. I mean, that was that was just the cream of the crop of this place, I think, and probably one of the best experiences in Mario Odyssey overall. So I think it, it'll be uh, it'll be neat to check out the next kingdom and see what we have in store for us. Wow, going way far across the map. Oh, we have two tr we have two options again. Snow Kingdom and Seaside Kingdom. Wow, so we have beach and we have snow. Aw, uh, man, this is a tough decision. Which one do you think Bowser went to? I, I, I want to go to the Snow Kingdom, actually. I want to go to the Snow Kingdom because we have had uh, the, the Lake Kingdom and Cascade Waterfalls and everything. The Waterfall King was the Cascade Kingdom. And I feel like snow is just going to be brand new to us. And probably some ice, and I saw some... Was it polar bears or penguins? There have to be penguins, like 64. Cold, cold mountain. So... We're going to take off. Burr, it looks so cold. It sounds like races in town are quite popular. Races. And the prize is a frosted, frost frosted cake. So that's what it was, a frost frosted cake. Bowser must have taken that as the wedding cake, for sure. I was going to actually skip that whole little scene. Um, Shiveria. Shiveria? Sounds like some Game of Thrones era. That's Game of Thrones stuff. Uh, look at this suit. The Cake Thief's parting gift. Wow, it's like you can't even see much because it's so snowy. It's a blizzard going on over here. Uh, wow, Mario is super cold. This is like, uh, this is like the Sand Kingdom. I, wow, the snow is actually piling onto the suit and everything. This is so sick. You know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to, I kind of want to change, change clothes a little bit. We've left the city. We're in the snow. I don't know how long it'll be until we get our Arctic thing going. So I feel like, should we be a captain? Cowboy, cowboy in the snow. I'm going to be scientist again, because we are up in this mountain, we're doing a little bit of research, checking out the snow, and this hair has to be keeping me a little warm, for sure, for sure, as if it matters, as if, as if any of that matters time zone, it doesn't, but to me, to me it does. Look at these snowflake coins, they're purple snowflakes, that's sick, okay. It's actually, it's, oh, wow, okay, I thought I just died, but I fell. Get out quick, is it- oh, is this- this is gonna hurt- oh, the water's gonna hurt me. It has to. Okay. What is this? Can I push this? Yeah, I guess I can, but it's not really letting me. Maybe I'm not- I should be able to push this block, right? Why can't I? I? I honestly don't know. Maybe there's something that I'll... There has to be some... Oh, there might be... Uh, maybe the enemy here or something? Like, there has to be some cap power-up that can help me out. But this will bring him back up to where the ship is, and we can continue on our merry way down this mountain. We'll probably break these things. Yeah, get some coins. Don't really need coins, but I wanted to make sure I could break those and all that good stuff. So, let's jump right off here, and I guess our objective was actually really close by. Okay, 
so we are... Oh, wow, what is this? This is pretty cool. Do you hear something in, under the snow? Is this the boss? Is this the boss battle? Whoa! Okay. <laughs> A giant hole. was not expecting that. That would be pretty dangerous. Okay. You scared us. These guys are so cute. Look at these guys. Oh my god. This is so... This is awesome. Oh, this is a painting to the to the uh, Forgotten Kingdom, I guess. The Lost Isles. This might be able to... Oh, no, it's not. What is that? I have no idea what that is. I didn't see that since when I was there last, so I've... I honestly have no clue. Leaving? Goodbye. No, I don't want to leave yet. I just got here, buddy! I just got here. Oh, here's a moon right off the bat. Oh, this is nice! A glowy yellow-orange moon. That actually looks really nice. It looks like sunset colors, honestly. Welcome to Shiveria. I love this. This is so nice. This little area. I honestly, I even feel a little, I feel kind of cold but a little warm just see, looking at these guys huddled up. No cake and no racing. These guys love their racing. Okay. What'd you gotta say? You got, what'd you gotta say, Mr. Man? He stole our racing prize. Whoa, is that, what is this? Is that a TV? Is that like a giant TV? These guys are just watching. That's so cool. This is like a camera out into the, into, into the overworld. These guys are high tech. These guys are high tech beings. So it looks like we have two doors. Oh, we have multiple doors. We have like three. Four, we have four doors. So let's just go into those and see what's going on. I guess we have to maybe beat a mission in each of these. I'm just gonna roll over here and see us through door number one. Okay. Okay, okay. We can get a few of these coins. Is the water gonna hurt me? Wow, that sh that ice stuff around the edge of the screen is really cool. It reminds me a lot of- oh, I'm feeling rumbling. Oh, it's just a heart. Okay, so I guess- I guess rumbling works for non-moons too. Oh! Wow. These are like- this feels like a chain chomp or something. Oh, but they're not gonna actually hurt- okay, they don't immediately hurt you. That's okay. I just wanna get- I just wanna get, I just wanna get, I just wanna get that purple. All right, sweet. So we're good on that front. Uh, I was gonna say, the ice around the screen gave me some serious Metroid Prime vibes. Like when you go underwater and the visor seems to get a little wet, or if you walk through a hallway with some steam, then the visor's edges steam up a little bit too. Serious Metroid Prime vibes. That's cool, I wonder if they actually take cues from the other games, from other Nintendo games, and use them, like cross, cross use them. That would be pretty sweet. But it looks like there's more purples up here. I'm going to... Oh. Oh, okay, I need to go through. Let's use... Oh! Okay, I'll just take this guy a little elevator up. Take me right up, thank you. And can you come over here? Thank you. Okay, this is kind of neat. This is kind of neat. Did not even need him to lift me up that time. Is there anything around here that I haven't gotten? Anything that I can immediately <laughs> scope out? Because I do want to move into the next rooms. The ice wall. Okay. Oh, we, okay. I thought it was going to take us right back outside. Oh. So there's like four levels that we need to go through. Energy of the power moon seems to open those barriers. Alright, let's go through door number uh, four, I guess. <laughs> because doing this out of that clockwise order that I would assume is the way we should do it. Whatever. As I said in the last episode, I'm an unconventional man. I don't do what is expected of me. Trying to trying to live up live up to that. Okay, okay what is this? Can I just clear out all the snow? Okay, Cappy's helping me out. Cool. There might be some hidden stuff inside. Ah, uh, no, nah, I don't think so, right? 
There can't be. Oh, the snow falls to the bottom once you get enough of it. That's cool, so you don't have to worry about getting all the way to the top. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's fly here. And this might open up another cyclone. Oh, is this the boss? We just got right into the boss. <laughs> so it might have been an actual like counter or clockwise order that you needed to go through the doors. Fussy about his cake. Didn't I fight you already, dude? Goofy man. We already had this battle. Oh, there's two of them this time? Okay. Okay, two hats. That's a thing. That's totally a thing. Just lose the sight of where I am. Gotta be a little smarter than that, buddy. Gotta be a little smarter than that to be a brutal. Nope. Oh, or maybe I might be fighting... This might not necessarily be the boss here, but... Maybe, uh, each other room is also a fight? I don't know. Because I'm just seeing this, uh, I'm seeing this moon panel over here. So I'm guessing this is not a multi-moon or anything, it's a regular mission. Alright, get that right off the bat. Wham! Is that it? Yes! Yeah. Yeah. So one, yeah, one moon. Okay, because we already we already got a multi moon from this guy, but they're packing they're packing more they're packing some more moons. There we go. Oh, <laughs> when you try to get some flare, snowy mountain barrier. Look at how ha happy Cappy is. He's happy Cappy, happy happy Cappy. Okay, that's another one down. You can move the camera during cutscenes, which is kind of neat. Uh, one sec, one second. Okay, and we're back. Um, Probably only took a second or two in the video, but I had to go fix a bunch of problems that my phone was having with its storage. <laughs> I am using my phone to record this, so that was uh, an issue that I saw happening when the clock started counting down to the last couple seconds I had for recording. Um, why is is the lighting why is the lighting so off on this? Is it flickering for you guys too, or is it just me? I think it should be good for now. Sorry about these uh, these tech issues. I'm still using um, I'm still pretty much using my phone and Elgato for the recording. So oh he's just he's just dead. Okay, knocked him. Oh, ouch. But yeah, I've had my fair share of issues, and editing is always a labor of love, as they like to say. So doing my best here, folks. Doing my best. Okay, so this needs four Goombas. That's that's an interesting little, that's an interesting thing. So there's two. I guess one of them came back to life while we were gone, and it's nice that they don't actually. S no, I don't. No, don't fall off. I don't want them to fall off, honestly. Oh god, I wanted to jump on him without accidentally like having him run off the screen. Is the flickering happening again? Is there? I don't- I don't know what this is. I don't know what the issue is here. I have uh, a super interesting setup here in my bedroom with lights, uh, my, my lamp pretty much facing directly at me. There is my phone on a box, on another box, on a third box, leaned up against a glass. So, yeah. If you guys want to know the secret to making these, just make do with what you got. Make do with what you got and uh, have a good time. All, all four, all four of you guys might be down. Down, do something like your boy Time Zone. All right. So one of the Goombas died again, and I don't know if I can just turn around and see them respawn, or if I'm just out of luck. God. All right. I'll be right back. Okay, so I exited and came back into the Icicle Cavern, and somehow three Goombas are already stacked up over there. 
So I this like procedurally generated for where the Goombas show up and how they show up. There we go. Okay, I had to take a hit, had to take a hit, but we have four Goombas now. And I'm gonna see, is this like a moon? Yeah, opens up a little section for us to grab a moon and we'll get our health back too, which is awesome. Which is awesome sauce. Awesome sauce. Ice dodging Goomba stack. Yeah, we definitely dodged all that ice. What is the point of these? Oh, okay, so I guess not all of the platforms are necessary. Uh, they just are a hazard, and sometimes the platform help you out with getting things too. So let's just, uh, okay, I guess I can dash you, which I have not, been, not jump that high. Oh! Okay. Here we go. Boom. There's two coming down here. Boom, boom. Okay. I'm just gonna stack, I'm stacking all of you guys. No Goomba left behind, boys, no Goomba left behind. We're having these. Is this gonna be like an arena or something? This I can definitely ground pound. Or, or no, I guess. What is this? Can I do something here? I have no idea what this is. So I'm just gonna, maybe I can break that. And then break this. Oh, something, this has to be a thing. This has to be a thing. Oh, there we go. There's a moon right down there. Sweet. Okay, let's grab this. Oh, but there's definitely more if we just kept going straight, right? Was there not a path to keep going straight? I... Okay, this is not going to take us back to the main entrance. I keep for some reason thinking when we have those event moons, the ones that give you that short little cutscene, they're going to uh, send you right back outside, but that is not the case. There we go. Oh, there we go. You saw that? Did you guys see that? Getting... Oh, just when I thought I was good at this game, I can't get up a ledge. A gosh darn ledge. Was there stuff we could do? Oh no, those are just... Okay, okay. That's what I thought. So there's just these four purple coins. And I'm just checking on time over here, fam. Just checking on time. So I got those four coins now. So let's... Drop right back down and go through this warp hole. I saw stuff happening up top, or maybe... Maybe those are just icicles. I guess it's not an actual different place to go. But did you guys... Was there a moon back there when we turned around? It, there was something spinning around, so it was either a coin or it was another moon. But we're back out here and we need to take care of our third mission. Was it this one? Did we just go in this one? No, this is new. What? Look at these giant things. Can we become this? We can become this! Oh, wow. This is sick. This is a really... This is a cool thing to become. I like that a lot. I also like their stun for a bit when you jump out of them, so you don't have to worry about them hitting you right out of the gate. You know, I, I don't really... Oh, I do need to... I need to be him right now. Okay. More coins over there. Not that. That way. Anything? Anything interesting? Oh, there's... Uh... There's like four purples. There's a three... There's three purples over there, which I'm not too sure how to get. I'm guessing I need to use this guy some... Oh, okay. Thanks, dude. I'm guessing I need to use this guy somehow to... Oh, I can... I can just move over there. Okay. Sweet. No, no. No, bad. Bad cloud thing. And I'm guessing that blowing all these guys off the ledge is going to give us our final mood. One more guy. I'm sorry dudes, I'm sorry you guys weren't doing anything, you were just enjoying life. You were just walking around here, maybe hanging out with each other, you know, chilling, maxing out. And, ooh, is that another moon? That might be some coins, or it could be another moon. Let's check real quick. I don't want to lose this guy while we're checking though. I'm gonna do this, get some coins, okay. I don't really need those that bad, we're gonna get them right back. Okay. Nice, good timing, good time management. So they call me Time Zone. Namesake, that's actually not why they call me Time Zone. It's not. The Gusty Barrier, okay, great. So we took care of 
these four things right here. Bound Bowl Grand Prix. That's our next mission, guys. For now, I think we're in a good spot here. Uh, I don't know if this went too long or if this might be short. 